England, oh Ireland, England, oh Ireland, England, oh Ireland, England, oh Ireland, oh way, oh way, oh. Shamrocks and roses, shamrocks, roses, thistles too. What? Come out home! Come out home! You dirty, let me in! I almost forgot. I'll be uh, uh, something. And stay out! And stay if I demand your presence, Hobo Tom, I will you. Oh, hello, my most esteemed viewing audience. I apologize for the ramblings and rantings of that madman, Hobo Tom. We're here in Florida. There is a hurricane on its way. Obviously, he started his hurricane party a little too soon. Wait a second. Play my music. Yes, that's enough of an entrance for this grandest weekend of wrestling. Comparable, dare I say, to an entire WrestleMania week. Hobo rearranged everything. Cannot believe. Such disregard for public warning. Let's talk about this weekend. It's a very intriguing weekend. Yes, it is indeed. For that person who I accosted from this room in this hovel. Mm. It's going to be watching at least probably about eight good hours of wrestling. Or we have two shows that he's going to be covering and that I shall make my esteemed predictions for. The first is NXT TakeOver. Of course, the birthplace of civilization in Cardiff, Wales. Yes. Let's talk about NXT TakeOver in Cardiff. Again, where there's soccer, civilized, more civilized game, rugby, culture, Cardiff at Arms Park, and probably some of the finest pubs in all of Greater Britannia. So at NXT TakeOver Cardiff, There are six scheduled matches. The hobo forgot to add in. I shall consider my bonus. Cesaro is scheduled or is rumored to make an appearance. Therefore, my bonus will be Cesaro shows up. And he shall either team... With or face Caius Ono. And that's my little bonus. I will not do that thing you please do with. Oh no. Oh no. No, his man's Caius Ono. Do not make a chance out of the fellow's name. And then, in my match of the night, there's Travis Banks versus Noam Dar, the Scottish Supernova. And in Cardiff, the Scottish Supernova will be the most celestial of all objects. For I have Noam Dar going over. In the match of the night. Then Dave Mastiff versus Joseph Coffey. Dave Mastiff will be victorious in his endeavor. Then in a triple 
a tag team match for the UK belts. We have the champions, the grizzled young veterans, Zach Gibson and James Drake. Take on Mark Andrews and Flash Morgan Webster, whom for some reason the hobo has his signature affixed to the door, to the bathroom door of wrestling. I don't know what he calls it. And then they take on Gallus. I have Gallus winning in this match. And then the prestigious UK Championship. Walter takes on Tyler Bates, the challenger. Walter retains, and this is my stone cold lock. And then Tony Storm faces Kaylee Ray. The Women's, champ Women's UK Championship, which is scantily heard of. With some scantily clad women. You call them that. This shall be my snooze match. Taking a nap during this. But I think Tony Storm shall retain. So just like the most prestigious one, Toro Yano. Let's take a break. And now for the second part of this day. Remember, NXT TakeOver UK starts at 2 p.m. Eastern Time. until 6 p.m. Eastern Time, and then at 7.30 Eastern Time, we have All Out. What is wrong with these degenerates of AEW calling their shows after the horrible grammar of each Trey Beist gambling events such as All In or in this case this weekend we have All Out and it's going to start with the 21 Woman Battle Royal so much gambling and Villainy involved! So villainous sounding. More, more, more wretched high of scum and villainy one has not seen. Ever since I came to this place called Daytona Beach. I'll go. Not much better though. So in the 21 woman battle royal, again, you can take a nap for this. It is that battle royal. Involving women, Britt Baker, shall advance, and for their first TV taping, she shall be one of the women going for the All Elite Women's Belt. Who are the others? Only time shall tell. Then we have Luchasaurus, Jungle Boy. And Marco Stunt takes on SoCal Uncensored. SoCal Uncensored. The Ruffians! For the Luchasaurus, Jungle Boy and Marco Stunt shall win. Then Private Party versus Anhedico and Jack Evans. Jobber, Jack Evans. Private Party will be pushed to the moon eventually once AEW gets its tag team away. Therefore, Private Party 
shall win. Another women's match, Riho versus Hikaru Shida. Again, the implications for this are wide-ranging. One of these women will be competing again for that AEW women's title. And therefore, it's going to be Riho who will be victorious. We have Darby Allen versus Joey Janela. Bad, bad, bad boy. Versus Jimmy Havoc. Joey Janela shall win, for he has been beaten up quite often. Darby Allen has a very good showing. Jimmy Havoc? Does Jimmy Havoc? Next, and not necessarily in order, Cody Rose versus the dastardly Sean Spears. Cody shall redeem himself after that vicious planted chair shot by Sean Spears. Shall be victorious, even though Holly Blanchard is in the corner of one Sean Spears. Yes, Tully Blanchard. One of them. And then the Lucha Brothers, Pentacon Jr. and Ray Phoenix take on the Bucks of Youth, the Young Bucks, Nick and Matt Jackson. Oh, folks, this is going to be the match of the night. For the Lucha Brothers shall be victorious. Then we have the best friends. Versus the Dark Order. Such nefarious men. In my stone cold lock. The Dark Order shall be victorious. They shall prevail over the best friends. Then in what could be the main event, not necessarily for this show, Pac, a native of Wales, of Welsh descent, coming up in the, playing rugby in the streets of Cardiff, takes on that lowly Canadian gamer, Kenny Omega. Former cleaner. Pac in his debut will be victorious. And then in probably the main event of the night, the hangman. Where's that? Hobo Tom, quiet! The hangman himself, Adam Page, shall take on Chris Jericho and to crown AEW champion. Therefore, Adam Page shall be the first champion of all elite wrestling. And I would like to thank all you people, yes, I am done my show. Let me finish, you, you slovenly hobo. Thank everyone for watching. Again, if you are in Florida, please be safe. Be prepared. Not like this hobo, but properly prepared with proper stockpiles. Woohoo, man!
that? Because there ain't no party like a hurricane party. Because a hurricane party don't stop.